Hey, what is up everyone? My name is Daryl and for today's video, I decided to look up uh, the top five best t-shirts that are under $15 according to Reddit. The shirts that I'm going to mention in this video get the most upvotes. So as you can see, Uniqlo U and Uniqlo Supima got the most upvotes then followed up with Target's Goodfellow and the last two are the next level in comfort color t-shirts. So my goal for this video is to um, review and see which one I think in my honest, humble opinion is the best t-shirt that is under $15. I will rank them based on the quality, fitting, durability, and the look. Then compare the winner against my current favorite basic t-shirt from True Classic Tee. So without further delay, sit back and relax. Let's get started. So before we start, let me tell you my stats, okay? I am 5'11 and wear slim stuff. Yes, I am pretty tall for a Filipino dude. Anywho, on the top of the food chain is the Uniqlo U t-shirt. Heavy duty t-shirt with a relaxed shoulder and vintage rugged look. The texture feels like sandpaper. It's weird because the female version has a smooth premium feel. The shirt is not that soft, but the durability seems promising. The color is thick and sturdy, so I don't think the color would be a problem after washing. I love how it fits on my body and for $14, I could already tell why a lot of people love this unique line from Uniqlo. Second one from Uniqlo is the Supima Cotton Crew Neck Shirt. Thinner compared to Uniqlo U and it's soft. It has the premium feel when you touch it and the arm hole is slimmer. The fit is great uh, pre-wash, not too slim nor too baggy. Lots of color choices. However, it seems a little short for my height, but I hope it won't shrink that much after washing. Same price as Uniqlo U, but I already like the Uniqlo U better than this one. Next on the list is the Target's Goodfellow shirt. The second most upvoted in the Reddit thread. Very budget friendly and it only cost you $6. I didn't see a slim fitting one, so I had to pick up the standard one, you know. I got no choice. Anyways, color choice are great. Soft, but not as premium soft. It's thin, it's boxy for my body because it's a standard fit. The shoulder length seems too short and I'm afraid that it will shrink more after washing. Like this fine, but then again, there's a potential of shrinkage due to quality. However, I can't really complain about it much since it's only cost me $6. The fourth one on the list is the next level premium fitted shirt. It has the premium feel, very soft to be honest, but it's as thin as the Goodfellow shirt. The fit is perfect for me. The armhole snugs my arms very well and the chest too. Length is longer compared to the other shirts in which I really like because I am pretty tall dude. I'll give you guys a hint, okay? The fit and the feel is almost identical to true classic tee, but we will see it after washing. And last on the list is the comfort color shirt. Bought it for $10 in gray and I could tell you right now, I am not a fan of the fit, especially around my arms. It's heavy tee and the fit is way too off to my liking and the color seems faded. The sleeve does not snug my arms and it's flaring. Like it's just too loose for me. I'm sorry, I can't really say anything good about this. I'm pretty sure this works for other um, body types, but just not my body, okay? Hey, who knows, this might feel better after washing it, but for now, this is definitely is last on my list. Now I got a chance to try them pre-wash. Let's put them in a washing machine and let's compare the pre and post wash. Remember to read the label guys, okay? Put your washer in the right setting. So for this shirt, put it at a cold temperature on a gentle cycle. After washing it, put it in a low heat dryer or air dry. Never ever put your clothes in a high heat unless you want to shrink your shirt. After washing them and putting in a low heat setting, here are the results.
after washing all the shirts and trying them back on, here is my final verdict. Before I say my number one overall best shirt under $15, I would like to recognize some of the shirts for being the best under the following category. First award, the softest shirt goes to Target's Goodfellow & Co t-shirt. Very soft feeling and for $6, it has the premium feel after washing. And for the next award, the award is for the best fit award goes to the next level t-shirt. Perfect around my arms and chest and the length of the shirt stays long after the wash. And here it is for the last award, the overall best t-shirt under $15 goes to the unique Lu Yu. My number one choice for this category, 30 color, has a relaxed fit, keeps the shape after wash, and it feels like this is going to last long. So I sense the durability of the shirt for $14. Not as soft, but I really dig the texture of the shirt. May not have the best fit for me, but those qualities that I mentioned put this shirt on the top of my list. And here is my ranking list from best to worst. Mind you, the good fellow came in second. I really think their shirt has a good potential, but because of the flimsy color, like a bacon color, let's say, and only comes in standard fit, this brings the shirt as the runner up. But then again, it only costs you $6. On the other hand, how would I compare this unique Liu to True Classic Tea? The answer is that I still prefer the True Classic Tea, and I'm not gonna lie, I highly suggest you guys invest on this shirt. True Classic Tea has that next level fit, softness of good fellow, and has sturdy color like from Uniquely You. It's pretty much got it everything that you're looking for the best quality shirt. Listen, I'm not here to promote the product, but I'm telling you this because it's the truth. Okay, I tested it and I tried it on my own. You know what? Go and try and experiment this yourself and let me know how it goes. That's my experiment for me today, guys. Don't forget to press that like button if you happen to like my video. And also, don't forget to subscribe if you like what you see in my channel. That's it for me. Stay safe and stay amazing. Have a good day, everyone. I'll see you in the next one. Peace.